Yeah, brother. Sorry about that mix. Let me check the number. Yeah. Sorry about that, boss. All right, that's our word. Just go on the way out of here. We link up. Cool. Respect. So hold on there, Carlton Wallace is Copper's real name? Copper? Yeah, Copper, King Right Hand Soldier. Oh no, no, that is a different person. <laughs> Miss Griffith, I'm even more confused now. Can you see this thing now, this young lady? Eh? So I go up at the house, she says she a Copper girlfriend and she in an abusive relationship. Right? I know you are telling me say somebody else woman. I don't understand where really I want. This really have made a spin. Me need to know. Miss Jane, I want you to just take a breath and calm down. The young lady is really a federal agent. But she was never in any danger. King Teller really say. Him just want to prove a point. I still can't understand why he would need to take a federal agent. Miss Brissett, you and I King have a very good relationship now. Why never just come to you and talk to you about the whole situation? I couldn't deal with it. Speaking on King's behalf, him never know. She is really an undercover agent. And this put him in a mess with him in and out. And there's nothing we only can do for him. We would love to, and it's not for lack of trying, but the hierarchy says King have to pay some time. We have protected King for a number of things where him doing a Miss Jane, but now it catch up with him. So I'm still I get charged for all of those charges I heard Mr. Savage reach out to him? No. Just the kidnapping. How long you think I'm looking at? Less than a year. It's not a prison and it's not really jail. It's a halfway house. So you can go visit him at times. So if me get a lawyer, so he can reduce the sentence or drop the charges. And another thing, why the young lady not come forward and say never kidnap her? Because he did kidnap her. Miss Jen, we get the reality of the situation. A better king do the time, plea guilty, which he has done already. If you go get a lawyer and go through this whole trial and court system, it may get a longer time. <laughs> Put it this way, it's a friend of his that get the deal you're fee. We want to see king come out. We don't want to see him in there and spend the whole heap of time. Especially the work we do for the community. Yeah, him did do bad, but he do good work for the community. And it's a show. So make him just settle with the less than one year. I can't make that decision there by myself. You know. I really need to see him in a Miss I really need to see him to talk to him. The decision has already been made in a Miss Jenny. Because he don't plead guilty. But as it relates to you seeing him, that's a one tree. Please, Miss Brissy. Because you see, the way our Mr. Savage came here and took him out of the house, never appreciated knowing that the two of them are friends. I understand, Miss Jenny. But if King did just step outside and listen to what Mr. Savage therefore say, it wouldn't reach so far. And I mean, it's out of respect. 
Mr. Savage never wants to say all of them things in front of you. Just please make the arrangement for me as soon as possible. Because, tell you the truth, from this happen, I not sleep, I hardly eat. It's as if, say, I'm out of this world in a space. You talk to me, I'm not even hear what people are saying to me. Because I'm just so out. I understand, Miss Jane. And as I say, whenever you're ready, just link me personally. And then I'm going to look out for food for him. And I can't care for food again. I can't arrange for that to happen, for you cook for you. But they are going to do them a regular procedure, like they are going to dig up the food. We can't, we can't run from that. That's all me want to say I can't cook him food. Because I don't really want to go down and go see my God and I'm not to really eat from people. One thing they're asking is, Jane, please keep this on the down low. Because men are really supposed to do this and we can get in a problem feet. Well, me can get in a problem feet. Um, and next thing, if you wish, we can work out for a conjugal visiting. What do you mean, Miss Brissett? I don't want to say that. What do you say? Ah, I just only one time. Miss Jane, I can't say say you love your things though. But um, I can see what I can do, like arrange maybe once every two weeks. All right. I guess I can live with that. Better not that jam shop right now. Well, I just said, let me come sit down with you and really explain what was really happening. All right? I will definitely keep you updated. And please, me, I beg you, don't worry yourself. All right? So, we talk. Let me call her, go outside. Am I right? I come to you, Miss Rissett? Um, please, say bubbles. Call me bubbles. No, no problem, no. As long as you take up any suffering. All right, Jane. I'm a right mega call, though. Give me a second. Hey, boss. Yeah. It's still up on it? It's still up on my good, so um, give me about 45 minutes to walk home. Alright. Make a call one of the driver. Alright, do that. Bubbles, you in a rush? Not really, you know. Why? Uh -huh. Come up a drink with me out of the bar now, like a ride now, come in. That sounds like a plan. Come on. Hello, good afternoon. Yes, my name is Donovan Chambers. Uh, is, is this the, the, the hardware? No, it's not. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Where exactly is this actually? A funeral home. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm, I'm so sorry. I, I don't know how I got the numbers mixed up. <laughs> Uh, what's, what's the name of this funeral home? Esperanza's. 
Okay, <laughs> well, you know, people die every day, so sometimes it's good to have these numbers. <laughs> yes, yes. Okay, uh, before you go, um, what if I needed a, a funeral package? I, I, and I wanted something very affordable. Who would I speak to? Ah, what's, what's the, 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 the owner's name? Yes. <laughs> I, I know that this is the main number, but um, could you give me his number personally? Just in case I need to speak to him to get the best deal. Oh, thank you. What's the number? Uh-huh. Thank you so much. <laughs> you have a beautiful voice on the phone. <laughs> I can't believe you work with dead people. <laughs> Okay, take care. Good, 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 good. Yeah. Look at the numbers for you. Two down. <laughs>